Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Code with Afiz. My name is Afizullah Masudi and in this video I will talk about the authentication in Laravel 9. Well, before talking about what options do you have in Laravel 9 for authentication, you must first know what is authentication. So, authentication is used by a server when the server needs to know exactly who is accessing their information or site. Now, in authentication, the user or computer both has to prove its identity to the server or client. In Laravel 9, you have this feature built in, which has made authentication very simple and fun for developers. These features provide cookie-based authentication for requests that are initiated from your web browser. They provide methods that allow you to verify a user's credentials and authenticate them while using your application. Now, because Laravel has many authentication services, it is sometimes confusing which one should we use. And believe me, when I say it's confusing, it is because there are many options which uh, look uh, same, but each has its own use case. And none of them is better than other. All of them are great features, and some of them are really both life and time saving. For example, if we talk about Laravel Jetstream, which is a new application scaffolding for Laravel applications. And it replaces the legacy Laravel authentication UI, which was available in previous Laravel versions. Will you have it? You have the UI authentication also in the Laravel 9. You cannot find it in the official documentation, but you can search for Laravel UI GitHub and you will find it there. And you can just set up Jetstream by running some commands and do a little configuration and there you will have your complete admin panel. Also note that Jetstream comes with both completely Laravel based application and single page applications. For completely Laravel based apps you can use Livewire plus Blade and for the single page applications you can use Inertia plus Vue.js. And if we go to the laravel.com and go to the documentation and make sure you have the right version selected and in the sidebar if we scroll to the packages tab and click on it you can see you you can find Jetstream in here and if we click on it it will redirect us to the official page of Laravel Jetstream where you can find all the installation and configuration uh, instructions and you can see we can use it both using Livewire plus Blade and also Inertia plus Vue.js. Well, we won't cover the installation here because this video is only an introductory video for you to have better understanding of which packages you can use for which reason. Now to talk about the second package that we have in Laravel 9, first of all let's get back to the documentation. And in the packages list, if we go to the top of the packages, you can see you have this breeze option available in here. And if we click on it, and in here you will find that uh, this package has minimal and simple implementation of all of Laravel's authentication features, including login, registration, password reset, email verification, and password confirmation. Well, the difference be between uh, Laravel Breeze and Jetstream is that Jetstream uh, completely provides you the admin panel. But in Laravel Breeze, you only have the uh, login or register or, or password reset or email verification and password confirmation. So keep that in mind. And you can use Breeze uh, also with Inertia and Next.js API applications. Now the next package that I want to show you is completely for uh, single page applications or mobile applications. And if we scroll to the packages back and in the list you can find Sanctum. And if we click on it, in here you will find that this package is a featherweight authentication system uh, which is token based and you can use it for single page applications or mobile applications. Now the final package that I want to show you is if we scroll to the list you will find Fortify in the list and if we click on it we'll think of this package 
is only for uh, the backend implementation for authentication in Laravel which means we have to take care of the front end on our own and uh, Laravel 45 uh, will only register the route and controllers that we need for implementing authentication features in our application now the question is which one should we use in our project well the one that prefers you the most and I myself like uh, being in control for both backend and frontend so I may use Laravel 45 above all the other packages but if you want something right out of the box in no, ti no time or as fast as you get you may want to consider Laravel Jetstream which provides everything you need as a starter kit for your application and if you want to have only the authentication you can use Laravel Breeze and if you want to authenticate a single page or mobile applications you can use Laravel Sanctum so guys these are the different options you have with the latest version of Laravel 9 which are useful in their own case and I hope now you have a better understanding of which one should you use for your application so I hope you enjoyed watching the video and learned something useful and if so don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and if you are new to this channel don't forget to smash the subscribe button if you want more videos like this so thanks for watching see ya in the next video